quite a few people seem to be having a few questions about how to type their answers into the Google Slides so that they don't have to um, print it out and, and fill it out and then resubmit it. So I'm going to go ahead and show you how. This is next week's lessons. I put exactly which slides you need to do for Monday and which slides need to be worked on. So on Monday, you're going to complete slides two through 10, but you're actually going to type your answers in on slides nine, on seven and nine. And then I did the same thing all the way through for Thursday. And then on Friday, I put the slides you're going to do, and then you have to do your, it's your show what you know day. So you're going to do three of these Google Forms. So when I say Google Forms, those are separate from the slideshow and they are attached here. So when you open your slideshow, this is what you see. Okay, you see all of these down the side, and then you see this in the middle. Now, if you go to present, Okay, so if you, there we go. If you go to present, you're gonna see this. It's gonna start reading the slides to you. It's gonna talk to you. It's gonna do teach you some of the lessons, um, but you cannot type in the boxes. It'll just click from one place to the next. So my suggestion is that you leave it like this you go to the very top, and then you can just click play, and it'll read it to you. You can stop, you can replay the volume here if you want to, and then you can go to, sl to slide two. Play the volume. This is your my book. This is your textbook that you're going to need. This needs to be picked up from the school front office at SES and it's up there already labeled and everything for you. So all you have to do is swing by and pick it up. We're going to go ahead and start needing that next week. As you go through every slide that has one of these little um, microphone looking things, you're going to click on that and it's going to talk to you and teach you. So here we go. You just keep going through. If you see things like this, it tells you exactly where the YouTube link is. You click on the YouTube link and it'll take you to the video. Okay, so you would let, watch the video and then you would close the video and come back to the slideshow. Now, after you watch that video this week um, of Zach Jumps In, then you're going to go to the next slide. This is where you're gonna type, okay? When you click here, you're able to double click. If you can see my, my cursor there, now it's gonna let me type, okay? I'm not typing anything real, I just want you to see. When you click out of that, I third grade. Hi, third graders. Okay, you're gonna type in your actual information, but I'm gonna show you how, now that I've moved to the next slide, clicking down the left side over here, okay, I can keep going, I can play the volume. You're gonna to come to the next one. It too has boxes where you can click and type. And watch, when I come back up here, my information was saved, okay? So you don't have to submit everything. All you have to do is each week, each day, type in on the slides that have these blue boxes and it'll save your work for you. 